Hello! Welcome back to my YouTube channel Victoria World. I am Victoria and as you can see, this is going to be my first video talking in English, so please don't judge me guys. If this is your first time in my YouTube channel, please subscribe in the red button below and leave me a like. If you have seen my previous videos, maybe you know that I play the cello, so I'm a violoncellist, musician and musical producer. But today I want to show you something really, really special for me. And it's this. It's this beautiful, tiny baby. <laughs> okay, seriously. It's this beautiful, brand new ukulele made by Makala. I bought it in the world famous ukulele store here in London. The name is Duke of Uke. I'm going to leave the name somewhere. <laughs> For this occasion, I chose a soprano size, obviously a smaller than a violoncello. And this is going to be my first time playing it, so I'm really excited. I'm going to share with you this moment of my life. First of all, I would like to talk about a little about the ukulele. Nowadays, the ukulele has become a very popular and beloved instrument. Maybe it's because of its versatile size and undeniably sweet percussive sound. Many people have started playing the ukulele in recent years, perhaps as a hobby or to get started in music. And for me, that's awesome. But today, guys, I want to show you my 24 hours progress on the ukulele as a cellist. The question is, can a cello player learn to play the ukulele easily? Let's find out! Okay, first of all, we have to tune our instrument. I made my research and the standard tuning is G, C, I'm going to use my tuner, it's the same that I used to tune my cello, so let's do this. Okay, so I suppose that this is the part of the video that I have to play. <laughs> mm, so, I'm not used to play any instrument with fret. The violoncello is a fretless instrument, so for me this is quite strange. Um, okay. harmonic instrument I will first learn how to do the basic chords for that I I bought this ukulele chords it's like a, a little book but it seems like a hand fun uh, it's really accurate because it's really hot right now here in London. Oh my gosh, I'm burning. <laughs> no, but seriously, I was having a look of this little book, and it's really nice because we can find here almost all the chords that you can play in the ukulele. So, like for that. Let me show you. Look, 
and in the opposite side we have more cords so it's awesome uh, this is, this video is not a sponsor though so I bought all these things by myself <laughs> please sponsor me <laughs> I'm a bit old school, so I'll be using this to learn some chord progressions. I'm going to show you some of these little book. I don't know. Actually, I don't know how to read this because are tabs. So this is new for me. So this is the C major chord. Um, I suppose that this circle here means that we just have to plug the string without pressing any, any fret. So, and the number here means that we have to press the third fret to make the C major chord. make some chord progressions and I will be back here. A minor chord is just pressing the second fret. For me this is the easiest. C major, A minor. Quite easy. F major chord. So Just press this string A minor C G major chord. So we have now three fingers. Um, this one looks more complex, but okay. Two okay yeah oh okay mm, this is a little bit difficult yes this one is a little bit more challenging than the previous ones but it's not impossible <laughs> okay everything was fine until the G major chords appears okay say that I lost my patience and I grow down all the basic score here in this paper <laughs> I was bored so I have it here so I will be studying with this as well just to make it quicker quicker
it away um don't forget to warm up to warm up your hands <laughs> before playing guys i'll be playing practicing and studying the ukulele all day long we're still having some daylight hello again i've been playing for a few hours now and it's getting easier and easier to make chord changes and i've been using my experience as a cellist to learn to play the ukulele easily. For example, practicing slowly helps a lot with muscle memory because you are aware of the movements you are doing. G major chord. I'm going for you. So, see you at evening. Keep watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Hello, guys. It's um, what time is it? It's 10 p.m. o'clock. It's night time. Um, I'm really exhausted, mentally exhausted. I'm mentally exhausted but it's okay because I'm really happy with my progress I think that it's it's been a productive day today and that makes me happy I would like to share with you something mm -hmm. like Percy Jackson is fighting with Zeus or something <laughs>
as you could notice last night, I was able to sing and play at the same time. My coordination was not perfect since I have to practice more the strumming patterns. It's new for me to play rhythm chords on a string instrument. For sure, having prior knowledge on a string instrument makes progress a bit easier. If you want to start from zero on the ukulele, I encourage you to do so. Thank you so much for watching my video. See you next time. Bye!